Hey everybody, it is the interview queen Alicia Atut here and I'm having an amazing weekend. I am currently in New Jersey as this weekend I've partnered up with RDP Promotions. He is bringing myself along with a bunch of other super cool guests. Um, we are going to four different shows here in New Jersey and New York over the span of three days. So four shows, three days. It's going to be so much fun. It's a bunch of different appearances, a bunch of different fans, a bunch of different shows. So. You've guessed it, this vlog is going to be all about this spectacular three days. I'm psyched. It's my first time working with Richie and this is going to be so much fun. So of course, you're gonna see behind the scenes stuff. You're gonna see the signing. You're going to get some interviews. So all I have to say is like, comment, subscribe, do your thing and enjoy. Mormon wife. He says Mormon wife. Schoolgirl. Sexy schoolgirl. Ding, 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 Look at what I just found. Hi guys. OG Ambi shirt. <laughs> Good evening guys. So ICW was a lot of fun. It was great signing, meeting fans, watching the show. Um, still in New Jersey, back at the hotel now. Um, today was just a pretty fun day and tomorrow's gonna be hectic. We're doing two events, one big wrestling convention and a uh, show. It's going to be knuck and futz, so tomorrow's going to be a lot crazier, a lot more guests, so I'm excited! Time to get some sleep! Good morning! It is another day on this RDP Promotions Tour. It's early. I'm doing my makeup, beating that face, painting that face. Um, I've been watching way too much RuPaul Drag Race, guys, but... I'm excited. Today we not only have a convention in Legends of the Ring, but we are also heading over tonight to Warriors of Wrestling. So it's going to be like yesterday, just a lot of chilling, meeting fans, talking. I'm excited. <laughs> Ready to go? I'm ready to go. That's you a just, wonderful thing. You just thing. do your thing. Because we're already rolling. You just do your thing, Daddy. Pope just got to make sure that he is primed and ready to be on film. You understand what I'm saying? Because we I'd only say, do it. I'd say you're primed and ready. We are here in New Jersey having a wonderful time. RDP Absolutely. Promotions. Woo! It's been a good day so far. Oh, man. It's been wonderful being out here uh, with all of your cohorts, with your fans. You know, uh, uh, just enjoying the atmosphere. And it doesn't get any better than sitting right here beside the one and only, the lovely, if you will, <laughs> Miss Alicia. Some say toot, I say tout. You understand <laughs> what I'm saying? No doubt. Now, something I discovered this weekend is that you have a massive, massive fascination with Pops. Oh, gosh. Come on, don't put me out there. But everybody knows Pops is, is indeed a, a massive, huge fan of Pop Vinyls. I got a collection that stands well beyond uh, 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 the parameter, if you will, of, of Pope's own crib. I've so, heard that might be around 2,000. Ah, man, yeah. yeah you, put, you, you put so much out there. <laughs> oh, Pope, Pope got, had to get a storage, you know. We got a, uh, you just can't, you can't, you know, once you pop, you can't stop. You can't stop the pop. Now, you have some fans here waiting for you, so I'll ask one last thing. Oh, take your time, girl. One last thing here. They're, they're, they're enjoying you just as much as Pope is. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> we just got to aim that over there. Um, what is the most prized possession in this collection? Oh man, um, uh, that would be a very unfair uh, statement to make uh, because there's so many great things, there's so many great pops that's been produced. Uh, but but if, if Pope got to go out on the limb, Pope's going to say the one and only Nature Boy Ric Flair exclusive. Okay from the WWE uh, 2K uh, exclusive re release. So that's one of my favorites. A true collector right here, the Pope, everybody. Thank you for hanging out. Hey, thank you, my girl. Love it. You're like, uh, like, uh, like I can't smile without you. I can't smile without you. Like I can't laugh and I can't sing because I'm freaking finding it hard to do anything. Yo, I'm out of here. Hey. Bill Raptor? Bill Raptor. <laughs> 
Raptor bitch. No, no, no. That's Bill Raptor. That's Bill Raptor. Got it. Got it. Yeah, everyone sign it and they respect Next up is the absolutely lovely Rosa Mendez on here. I'm so happy I'm finally able to have you here. Yeah, I know. This is the first time, and I've seen you a couple times if we've never done an interview. Not yet. Now, the thing I really wanted to bring up with you is yes. the fact that every time I see you, head to toe, your style is always on point. Oh, thank you. You're very welcome. But with that being said, a lot of the time when you're super stylish, you have some faux pas when you, you know, are looking at other styles. Yeah. So is there anything that really drives you crazy within fashion? Any big no-nos? Um, I'd have to say, you know what, there is no big no-no's because I feel like when you're dressing yourself and it's you're being creative, there should be no no-no's. That's, that. that's a person's creativity and putting stuff together. And if you love fashion, I feel like you can clash, you can do stripes with with circles and polka dots or whatever and I just feel like you embrace it. And it's all about how you walk and how you present yourself. So there's no no-no's in my book. I love that. And is there ever an outfit you look back on where you're like, whoa, that was crazy, but that's not a no-no. <laughs> that is a stylish outfit. <laughs> I gotta say, there was that one, uh, it was a WWE photo too. It was an orange, it was when I was with Primo and Epico. An orange, like really, really tight top with a black bra and bright electric blue leather Ooh. shorts and a black belt and it's complete <laughs> and black boots. It had like it made zero sense. But you rocked it all the but same. People buy those photos now and they love them and I just look back and yeah, it was a very clashy outfit, but I embraced it. I so love it. That's good. You have to have that mentality, not only in fashion but life, just embrace it. Yes, right? and I gotta say your style is bomb all the time. Thank your you. hair, makeup, beautiful. I so you're that. killing it. Thank you. Yeah. I'm so glad that we were able to do this. Yeah. Everybody Rosa Mendez. Hands are amazing. I got more yesterday too. Guys, I'm gonna get real fat. <laughs> So now we are done at Legends of the Ring in New Jersey. We are going to drive to Staten Island for Warriors of Wrestling and then sign there. So, yeah. Good evening. I'm exhausted. It's midnight and I'm back at the hotel. This hotel's nice, guys. It's like swanky. Yeah. <laughs> um, tomorrow's the final, final day on this RDP tour, so I'm gonna get some Z's and let's have some more fun tomorrow. So now we're heading over to the Wrestling Universe store. We have Joey, Pope, Richie, Nigel, and myself gonna be doing some signings, and then that is the final event of the weekend. Nigel wanted to say something, now he is back. So I just wanna make it absolutely clear that we did play a guess the movie game we in did. the car. We did. And I won oh dramatically. <laughs> Richie, who's not a good driver at the best of times, to be honest, <laughs> scored minus one. He did get a negative Ooh. one. Yeah, so, I sure did. Well, props to you, Nigel. Best movie game player in the world. I won't go that today. far. Oh, well, well, I won't go that Oh, now does Pope have I something mean, to seriously. say? Seriously. I mean, he, he got off to a fast start. I wasn't really involved in the beginning, but I what? did. I mean, I came around. I, I kind of got, you know, I kind of got more into it because I got a little competitive. So, okay, you know, once it becomes competitive, I'm in. I guess congrats to you both for a game yeah, well played. Yeah, I mean, N N Nigel was on, no, man. this isn't like, like you get a fucking trophy for competing. What I mean, Nigel, you <laughs> freaking, I won. I'm gonna, you, you had the advantage. I'm going to let them hash this the out. I had the clap. Nice end on that. Hope had the clap. <laughs> and the cut. Hey everyone, after what was a really long but super fun weekend, I am finally back home i'm going to get some rest because those were a lot of late nights a lot of talking and i just had an absolute blast uh thank you so much once again to rdp promotions for having me out thank you to everyone in both new jersey and new york who came by said hello got some merch uh just chatted i had a blast this weekend so time for sleep now